a really good question, actually. Um, it has shifted that mentality of, I am in my classroom all by myself. Um, and so we've really worked to create that environment for collaboration um, and that we don't have to be the sole provider of everything. Um, and so that has really been a mindset shift that our teachers who have been involved in this process have had to embrace and kind of learn and, and let go of some stuff. Uh, and so that has been really good. So I think really that the biggest shift we've seen was towards a more student-centered design way of thinking. Um, curriculum used to be, I work in isolation, I get paid to write some maps out, they become PDFs and nobody sees them, and I write them for how I want to teach them. Now, through the process of OER, curriculum has become more collaborative, it's become a living, breathing document that the nature of OER that you have to have that upkeep uh, from you know month to month or year to year. I really think the perspective is about control. So before we started using OER, I think teachers felt compelled. There was no there was there there was no textbook police or curriculum police, but they felt compelled to start at the beginning of a textbook and then work through it. So when when we started removing that physical representation of a scope and sequence from them and, and ask them to design um, the learning path with, with our instructional standards and then using open educational resources to support that, I feel like it gave them um, a lot of power to make choices about what they really thought students should be learning. Um, I think initially when you start the professional development and throw out that terminology of OER and creating your own resources, I think it's a scary thing for many teachers because it's new. Um, sometimes just having that tangible textbook uh, is comfortable for a lot of teachers. Um, it's traditional, so tradition sometimes directly correlates to comfortable. Um, but with the right professional development, um, the process, working together and, collab and collaborating, um, I think it has empowered teachers.